now in this video we're going to introduce the NPN bipolar junction transistor to this series of videos. So transistors in general have the basic property of a weak signal being able to control how well the transistor conducts. Thus you can take a weak signal and control a much more power hungry circuit. We're going to use the 2N3904. When you have the actual component you may need magnification to uh, read it and uh, this magnetic screwdriver actually picked it up. But in any case, we're going to use the 2N3904. This is the pin layout, left pin emitter, middle pin base, and right pin collector. We have to insert it uh, this way. When you look at a schematic diagram, there you can see even a weak signal from my finger is enough to get the transistor to conduct a little bit and let the LED conduct a little bit. But uh, there's a schematic symbol, NPN, the arrow points out, PMP, the arrow points in. But we got that collector on top there, base in the middle. That's the uh, signal that controls it. The collector, the load is on the collector side. And uh, how well the transistor conducts depends, will determine how well the load conducts. Different uh, NPN bipolar junction transistors will often have a different pin layout. So here we zoom in. Right now, no currents flowing through the base to emitter, which does drop about 0.7 volts, but otherwise we got uh, 5 volts, 10 kilo ohm resistor, which would make an LED really dim by itself. But there you can see the LED is really bright. So when it comes to NPN bipolar junction transistor, the amount of current flowing from base to emitter, the collector to emitter will let probably 100 to 300 times as much uh, current. So more than probably 20 milliamps of uh, current will be allowed through, but the load limits the current. So we got a red LED and uh, pretty much the bare minimum you want for a resistor in this case, 150 ohms. Usually I use 220 ohms. But in any case, that is setting the current and how bright the LED is. Whereas over here you can see when the uh, switch is open, no base to emitter current means that it won't let any current from collector to emitter. The 2N3904 has an absolute maximum of about 200 milliamps of current it will allow to flow through there. So you really only want to use it for circuits where you got uh, less than about 100 milliamps of current. So in any case, that is the basics of using an NPN bipolar junction transistor as a switch. Thanks for watching.